So this is the Travis Scott Air Jordan 1. You guys have seen it before, obviously, but what I wanted to do was like, I really like this model, but I wanted to flip the swoosh on these. All right, guys, we made it to Jacques' house. We're gonna check out his uh, sneaker collection right now. Yo, what up, yo, yo what? don't even worry about us. We're just gonna, just... yo, oh, the camera. Right, we're, we're just gonna check out some of your shoes. You just do your thing. We'll, you won't even notice we're here. Okay. Don't, don't even worry uh, about us. Here it is, guys, uh, check this so, yeah. out. Yeah, so, so, yeah, so he's got a the, ton uh, of sneakers. Reverse, guys, well, I need you to be huh? a little quiet. Like, they can't hear me. If you're... Oh. Oh, you're working. Yeah, yeah. I thought I was you were trying to just, okay. I just want to show this. Oh, got you. Oh, my bad. My yeah. Bad. So the um, so I got, I had both so of the, the swooshes reversed. Basically, the what they did is they took so one off shoes. of this shoe. Oh. Oh. Uh, uh, sorry. Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. I think we're in trouble. Yo, yo, yo! Hey, guys. Pop. Jock Slade here. Uh. Really, this is your channel. Yeah, this, this is my this channel. Is what is going on? I'm here with my guy Jacques Slade in his uh, studio dome <laughs> house, whatever this is. Thanks um, for coming. This is awesome. Yeah, let's do it, man. You want to just get started? There's a bunch of sneakers behind us. Yeah. There's a storage unit. Yeah, yes. And uh, you get a lot of stuff from the companies. I do. Um, I get a lot, a lot of exclusives. Stuff. Yes. A lot of things that come out. So there's a lot to see. Okay. Let's, 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 let's just go through it. Yeah. All right. Let's go. I have in here you start with these so this is what we're just doing at the front i wasn't a big fan of the reverse swoosh and so uh, since i had two pairs i reversed it you can still it looks a little sloppy because like the glue is still there got to clean some of that glue up but it's pretty cool yeah i thought it was, i think it looks good both ways yeah sample pair of the trophy room fives it's the same pair like outside as everybody else's but they're not numbered so everybody else's uh, is numbered so these aren't was this a These are was this a purchase? Was this a gift by Michael Jordan himself? <laughs> no, no, I was, I was actually I did. I was doing a show. I hit uh, Jordan Brand. I was asking if like there was anything that they wanted to highlight, and they sent me these. Something that I recently got. I ordered these on Nike by You. I think people were into this one the most. Wow, with the gray on the front. Yeah. Oh wow, I, that looks really good. I kind of wish I would have made the up the back part gray. Like when you did your your parody video about me getting the refrigerator. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is a kind of a small package compared to what they've sent me before, but... Okay, so... Wow. Oh, wow. A fridge. And then I got the, <laughs> the wine refrigerator yeah, like two weeks later. <laughs> I was like, what? This is pretty cool, so... The Nike logo is in like the Wheaties and then it's like milk. Then when you open it up... It has like the Wheaties bowl. So this this is the only one that has the bowl, the spoon. And I think all of them just have, the rest of them just have either just the bowl or they don't have the cereal or something like that. So this one comes with, so you get the bowl and the spoon, but you don't get cereal with any of the other ones. These are some of the Yeezys that I have. Fun fact, I've never actually worn any of them, like ever. No way, you've never ever. worn a I've, I've never worn an Adidas Yeezy. I feel like everybody was wearing them at point and I was like, all right, every, every, like everywhere you go, everybody's gonna have them. And like in all the events that we were doing, it's like everybody's wearing Yeezys. And I was like, oh, I'll just wait to wear them. And then like, I kind of just kind of grew out of that Yeezy phase. I was like, ah, I don't know if I really want to wear them now. Yeah. And so now I have them. They're literally all brand new. Like, I don't even think I have, I've put them on my feet. That should be mine. The real, the real champ is here. This is a fun one, not, it's not super hyped or anybody will know about it, but this is a, the shoe that I made for uh, for Fomer and his brother oh, for the nice. when I did the Nike by You. They yeah. did the Prestos, the, the custom insoles. So this one was for Young Buckets. So they That's let me sick. they let me make like custom insoles for them. Oh, I have these. I, don't, I doubt many people know what these are, but it's a, it's a cool sneaker based on a I forgot what's it, I forgot the album, but they, these are Brooklyn Brooklyn Projects. They did a collab with Nike. Can't have a, have a T-shirt too, but I think that's in storage. Yeah. So these are the, the fragments. I've never worn these. Never worn these? No. And was this you see, they're already like getting like a, or? Yeah, so you get that, that, that like glitter yeah, stuff sometimes. That. Speaking of that glitter stuff, here, look at this. Yeah, so this is like the, the band one. When were these? What year was this? Ship by 15. So this says this is season fall 15. So this is a this is a promo pair, but like you can see, like it's all over. Like look how bad oh that is. Oh my god. Looks like you wore these in the snow or something. Right? Yeah. I notice if you wear them, they don't get that stuff on them. Yeah. And like those, like I've never worn those. And I think that's why those look like that. This is where a lot, like I wear these all the time, as you yeah. can see. Like they're just trashed. 
These are from what, All Star New, New Orleans. Orleans. Yeah, yeah, so like All Star New Orleans, like I wear those all the time. I wear these a lot because they're like, really yeah, it's just super comfortable. Super comfortable. This was the first pair of shoes I was seated by Jordan brand back in like 2011. Yeah, and so like, I've, obviously I can say I beat them up, like the tag is all off, but I still, I still wear them. I think these are dead stuck. I don't think I've worn these, wow. or maybe I have, let me see. Maybe I may have worn them once, or, or maybe or maybe I wore them in here when I was like doing the unboxing or something. Yeah, this, this I wear, obviously you can see that I wear these a lot too, um, by how beat up they are. When I got, when I got fired, these shoes came out like right around that time and so like it's been like my my theme of like start your own business kind of yeah. thing that's been like that's been like my motivation my favorite shoe to play ball in still like it's so hard to beat those i've worn these in the snow i've worn these everywhere i still feel like this is one of the best basketball shoes like yeah, the I crazy really like um the crazy light the boost the boost crazy light this is I feel the like... first basketball shoe with boost in it yeah 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 and this yeah. is like it's so it's so good i think people really slept on these these least what e3 two years ago yeah in los angeles yeah right? and then these uh was one of the earlier the, i think this is the first or second john elliott yeah icon just i just love i love love, really love this shoe. shoe another one of my my favorite the black and red fours again you see they're just beat up but just like, I love to wear these things. I've had these for a while, and Kais calls, calls me a hype beast when I wear them. Yeah, Actually, yeah, I haven't yeah. worn this one. I haven't worn this one. I wore the, the black sole pair. I have this pair too, but the black, I wear the ones with the blackout sole. Nice. Shout out Anthony Davis is on the Lakers now. This is uh, his, his all-star shoe from, I think, 2016. More Jordan 29s, just because they're freaking amazing. These are great basketball shoes, although you probably can't find them anywhere now. Oh, these are, uh, when Blake was with the, with the Clippers, they did a uh, a special for, a special release for him with the Hyper Dunk. Um, so these kind of like glow in the dark. One of my it's one of my favorite Hardens, the one, but the this pink colorway. Yeah, these are so good, really nice. I wish they did more stuff like that. These are cool. Like these were cool in concept, but like they're 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 they don't wear fit well. Just like they're so stiff. Everything is so stiff. But I think like the colorway and the, the option, like Nike basketball obviously doesn't do this anymore. This is what the 10, this is a 10. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like Nike basketball doesn't do like the lifestyle versions of the shoes anymore, which kind of sucks. My beat to death Yeezy twos. <laughs> like I've lost the, the lace eyelets, like the dirty, like look at the outsole. It just, yeah. I just didn't treat these very well. I just, I liked them. And so I just like, I wore them and then yeah. I just got beat up. I need to clean them up. Imagine if I clean them up, they'd look a lot better. These are the best, the best Iversons ever made. Maybe the blue toe, maybe the blue toe, yeah. but I don't know. Like, I feel like these two are the, and then this is like a really good quality for like these, like the black of Royal, like the leather on these is so good. Like it's one of like the few pair that I think they did a, a, just a black and gray pair like these as well that has the same quality leather. Like if you can find these, like the leather on these is amazing. Like All right, so we checked out your office space, but yes. there's a ton of more sneakers in the storage unit. So yeah. let's go check it out. Let's do it. First thing I noticed was the Bear Brick Dunks, the Dunk Lows, these are sick. Sonic fans, or video game fans, the Puma Sonic collab. Really dope pair was this blue pair, one, right? was the blue one. The furry blue yeah, one, they killed it. Yeah, this is so good. I gotta bust these out when the movie comes out. Right, has Sonic the Hedgehog there, has the coins right there, has like the road that he runs on, like this is such a good job. And then like the material they use. Perfect. The, the must be the honey LeBron. It's, yeah. a, it's, an, it's ended up being, it was a like Nike ID, I think, at the end of the day. But it was a collab they did with Honey Nut Cheerios, and it has like must be the honey. This is a very special pair. So I did a video collab with uh, Vern Troyer before he passed. And these, uh, I gave him these to wear. And uh, when he passed, his parents gave them back to me, told me that I could keep them as like my own little cinnamon moment with Vern. So always have hold on to those. This used to be a these used to be a thing. Oh, those were great. They <laughs> Jordan, were great in it. These time, these are man. these used to be a thing, uh, the Jordan Future, but that all that vibe kind of died out. Shout out to Big Shaq. Wow. I was gonna save these for last. It's like probably the the hottest shoe in the collection. This is the Under Armour BB. I think it's called the BB8. 
Charge BB. Sorry, the Charge BB. This is before Curry, so Under Armour uh, BC. <laughs> but yeah. You could play basketball in these. The and funny you thing can is, snowboard. Though, and you can snowboard. But the funny thing, like, they're mad comfortable, though. Like, really? they're really comfortable. They're not. They're not a bad basketball shoe. Like, I it looks like that crazy. Just holds your calf in or something. <laughs> yeah. Like, it would have been funny though if they would have launched that as the Curry One because of his ankle issues at the time. <laughs> These are the ones we were at the. Uh, remember when we were at the um, at Staples Center? Yeah. Yeah. This is the one where I won the uh, won the thing. So was that the first time I met you? I think was it that was the first time we met. We were outside the Nike because this was when Kobe's like retirement around that time, yep. right? And I remember it was at a Kobe event. <laughs> Oh, you, got you got it? Stop lying. Four, two, oh. Yeah, and I was like, of course he's going to win. I was like, that's got to be rigged. He's in with Nike. You got to try the Pro Troll 5s. They're really good. This is like the first curry. They did this like really cool box. Like when you open it up, like the shoes kind of like lift up out of it. That was really dope. I still feel like these were the best curries. These were super comfortable. Yeah, those ones I are really good. I loved playing in these. These were really good. Out of all the sneakers and all the stuff Jacques has done, I think the one thing that I'm the most jealous of is the fact that he got to interview Kobe multiple times, right? Yeah. Multiple yeah, I times. Lucky. I don't think I've won. Have I won these? I think I won them. I may have won them once. Undefeated. Yeah. The inner hype beast comes out again. The inner hype beast comes out. This is literally the D Browns, right? Yeah. Dude, look at that. So fire. They need to bring these back ASAP. There's, there's Nightwing's shoe. He has, he's like, he's the only sneaker guy that has an actual shoe. shoe of all yeah. of us, he's the only one. So shout out to Nightwing uh, with that wear testers love right there. What do you think about like YouTubers getting sneakers and stuff like that? I think that's dope. I would what love. did you think about the Ninja, the Ninja Adidas collab? I thought it, like it wasn't, it felt like it was just a collab. It wasn't like a Ninja shoe, you know what I mean? Yeah, it felt yeah. more like they just kind of put a name yeah, on it, yeah. but I would love to see like Ninja get his own shoe. That'd be yeah. dope, like for us yeah. to in that, that are in that world. Yeah. To kind of, to open that door, open that door for us, you know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. So can... I feel like the brands will slowly see it. I mean, Hopefully, hopefully. Yeah. Shout out to Nightwing having his own shoe. I've never posted these or put them up anywhere. Brazzers? Brazzers, yeah. I've oh, never man. posted them or put them anywhere. So, oh yeah, so you sample, not for resale. But yeah, it's like the Brazzers Air Force not One bad, high. Yeah. It's not bad. It's not crazy, but I just don't see myself wearing some yeah. <laughs> Brazzers. Not that anything wrong with that. It's not a good that. conversation starter. Like, yeah. hey, what are those... Those sneakers. Yeah, it's oh, it's the bra Brazzers. That's, that's it. That's it. That's yeah, we'll end it on that one. Yeah. yeah, we'll end it on the Brazzers. <laughs>